Hey guys, this is Leisha and I kind of just got back from Bangkok. Well, not really just got back because I went to Bangkok in July and now it's September so it's pretty darn late for a haul video. But um, I've just been kind of busy because I was kind of going on a holiday marathon. I went to Bangkok and then straight after that I went to Hong Kong for a family vacation and then on the day that I touched down in Malaysia from Hong Kong, the next day I had a flight to Phuket where I went for a holiday with my friends. And now I am back. So I was thinking, hey, you know, why not just do a haul video since I'm free? And here I am. So let me just tell you that I only shop in Bangkok. I don't really shop when I'm here in KL. So I go like literally all out in Bangkok and I just kind of lose myself there. So, um... Yeah, I hope you enjoyed the huge amount of stuff that I bought and I'll just section it from like clothes to like jewelry, bags and shoes. So I hope you enjoyed this and keep on watching if you want to see what I bought. Yay, bye! Oh my god, I actually bought so many shoes. I didn't even realize I bought this many shoes until I kind of grouped them all up here. Oh my god, I feel so guilty but... Oh well, more shoes for me. So the first shoe that I got is kind of like a normal flats, ballerina flats, which is in electric blue, which I absolutely love because it's so bright and colorful. And I also got the same one, but I bought it in red. So, so pretty and so bright. And then more flats, more flats. I got these really cute brown flats which I absolutely love. I've been wearing it like almost every single time I go out because it's just so comfortable and it's like kind of brown snake skin-ish kind of design and it's got this cute little bow behind which adds a little bit of you know personality to the shoe. A little bit from from a plain brown flats. And I also got these um orange loafers which I thought was pretty cute and I don't really have any orange shoes so I thought you know orange loafer would be good and then I got these um really cute flats which has a gold lining to a nude flat which is for me I think it looks kind of chic which I love and then I got these leopard printed flats just a plain brown one which is uh, cute and then I also got this one same design, just a different color and a little bit different because it has like shoelace in it, which I don't know, it's pretty. And um, yeah, the last flat that I got, the last ballerina flats, is this really cute crochet plastic flats. Um, they don't look like they're plastic from afar, but if you come really close, they are made of plastic and they are super duper comfortable and I love it. And yeah, that's all for the ballerina flats. Now for my sandals. Um, <laughs> the first one that I got is this really cute and colorful sandals. I think it's really cute, the little details, and it's so fun. And then I got these um, black ones with kind of like chains and, I don't know what's that, stones. Which I thought was really nice. And then I got these blue ones pretty and then I got these mustard colored ones which will look really nice in a maxi skirt what am I saying a maxi skirt or a dress and then I got these colorful brown ones so cute and last but not least these baby killer heels you're like damn girl that can kill you it's so it's so cute don't you think and it's kind of like made up of suede material so it's kind of cute and damn girl look at those so yeah that's i think that's all the shoes i got i think i hope <laughs> And it's accessories time! I absolutely love accessories, so when I go to Bangkok, I shop for accessories like that. And the first one that I got is this pretty gold one with grey stones in it, which I think is 
so cute and so pretty and it's just not too much of a statement piece it's just like just adds a little bit of you know dressiness to the outfit and I got these plain gold one that just you know it's kind of bold and you know just adds a little bit of color to your outfit and then these are so pretty it's like this dangling black one and it's just so mm, girl and this one is my favorite buy it's so pretty and guess how much it is please guess how much it is it only cost me 15 ringgit 15 ringgit ringgit it's like oh gosh so pretty and, and if you follow me on twitter or on instagram or on facebook then you would know that i absolutely love this one and i've been wearing it like a lot because it's just so pretty love this my best buy my baby next for bracelets and bangles i got these um snakeskin printed ones which i think is nice because it can match with almost everything um, and then I got this brown, brown, black, oh gosh, I'm colorblind, black one. And then this one, I think it's really, really pretty and cute. It's just an owl kind of design and ta-da, so pretty. And I think that's all the bracelet I got. I think it is. Now time for rings. I got these um, black ones. It's a black stone one. And I also got one in brown. <laughs> and then I got these kind of ring black one. And then I have a blue one. And then I have a small black one. And then I have a white small one. <laughs> and um, I think that's all the accessories that I bought. No, no, no. I have another two more. But I don't have it with me right now. It's with my sister. So um, probably I'll show you guys in another clip or something. So yeah. Yay! Okay. So these are the other three accessories that I mentioned. I bought this for my sister because um, she wears a tudong, a scarf. So sometimes when you wear a scarf... That doesn't mean you can't accessorize. You shouldn't limit yourself to just basically having a scarf as your accessory. You can always accessorize and make do with what you have. Which is why I bought her these items. Mainly also because she likes to wear black. So when you wear black, it kind of just drowns you into this deep, dark color. Which is not really that good. So in order to kind of pump up her outfit and you know give it a little bit of color i bought a few accessories that are more colorful but yet very wearable for example like this one it has like all these colorful beads which i think is pretty cute and because she wears sudong um i would suggest that she is long because she wears sudong so you can put this underneath a layer of one of your tudong and it will just kind of peek through and just give it you know that nice color so i really really like this one and then also another color piece is this one here. It's just a plain necklace filled with, you know, dangly strings and again colors to just kind of peek through. Um, really nice because they're like bright. They have another one that is uh, lighter and more pastel but I think this one is a lot prettier and more vibrant in color which will kind of help, you know, liven the um, darkness. And the last one that I got for her is this chunky piece. Um, I think this one would be a more bold accessory to go with her outfit. And yeah, I guess that's what I bought for her for accessories. Okay, now it's time for bags. And I didn't really buy a lot of bags. I bought like one, two, three, four, five, six. I bought six bags. But one is not with me because I gave it to my sister, so I have five bags here. Which is not too bad, right? Not too bad. Yeah. So the first bag that I got is this kind of like a satchel bag. It's, um, what color is this? It's kind of like a grayish, taupish, purplish, I don't know what color this is, but yeah, I would say taupe, a light taupish color. Um really pretty I think it can match with anything it has a long strap you can adjust it long or short however you want it so pretty I love this one 
and this one has got to be one of my favorite bags that I bought. It's like a green green bag. Um, again, a satchel bag with a adjustable strap. And I love this bag because I think the green is a really, really pretty green. I don't think the camera is doing justice to this green, but this green can match with basically anything and everything, and I absolutely love it. And it just gives that pop of color on your outfit, like not like a yellow kind of orange kind of color, but a pop of color, but subtle, you know, not to va va voom kind of color. So this is one of my favorite, and I've been wearing this quite a lot recently. And then I also got a boxy um, bag. Again, strap is adjustable. I love, you know, kind of just slinging the bag on my shoulder. Not across, on my shoulder. And black, which I think, I need a black bag. I don't know why, but I don't think I have a lot of black bags. I have mostly brown, so I think I might use this soon. Then I have the same bag, but I bought it in yellow. And I just think that this color is just so fun and young and so summerish. Like if you go for a picnic, this would be perfect. Like, oh, so sweet. I just want to eat it. And the next one and the last one that I have here is a very, very cute round pink bag with golden zippers. And like a gold chain handle strap. And I think it's just, it's just pretty, like, it's just like a hot pink, and it's not like a, you know, like a dull pink, it's a really, really bright, hot pink. And I think this is just perfect for, you know, if you just want to brighten up some outfit, a dull outfit, and you just want some color, and this is just gonna do the job perfectly, so, love this one. So, yeah, that's all for the bags. Um, I think, uh, I did buy some you know, pouches and stuff. For example, this one over here. This one. But it's just a pouch, so I don't think it, you know, counts as a bag. So. Yeah. Okay, this is a dusty pink top with sparrow details printed on it, which is so super duper cute. And this is a white creamish top, which is kind of see-through, and the shoulder is cut out, so it kind of adds a little bit of sexiness without showing too much skin. <laughs> this is just a plain flowery top, and more flowery top, which is more flowy, and um, yeah, looser. I think this is a really cute tank top with a ribbon at the back, which you can adjust, and um, it's flowery printed, super cute. Now this top I thought would be really really nice for Raya, like you can wear it with a sarong underneath and it's green so it's such a nice bright color. And this is just a plain black see-through top, you know, which can match basically everything. Now this cardigan is my current love. It's just the perfect cutting, it's flowy at the the front and it's just not too tight not too loose and I also got one in cream because I just love it so much and uh, oh gosh can't tell you how much I love this now this one is more of a hippie kind of top which is kind of loose and you can just tie it great for beaches I would say and this is a really really cute tie-dye crop top which I think the tie-dye effect is not too much so it's just nice and this is my Galaxy shirt. I think the cutting is really, really nice and perfect because it gives a slimming effect. And the collar, oh my god, that's a collar tip on it. So, so cute. And this is just an oversized shirt that I bought, which can be worn as an outerwear. I got it in this color, which is kind of like a coralish orangey color. And I also got it in purple because you can never have enough shirts can match with anything. And this is a cute summerish top, which is kind of sleeveless, but it has a little bit of sleeve. And this is a normal kind of uh, flowery printed top. And then we have this top, which has a cute little zipper at the back. And this one I think is really, really pretty. I love the printed details in front. 
it's a bit edgy and I don't know, it's just nice. And this is just a white grayish v-neck top. <laughs> this one is just an orange top with ribbon cut out on the shoulders. And this is just a green colorful top which I don't even know why I bought it. And then we have this zigzaggy top which is super duper slim and tight. Oh, and I absolutely love this electric blue top. So flowy, you can just wear it so many ways. Like this one, for example. So, so bright, so pretty. And I also like this mustard colored top with a black pocket detailed in front. And also this stripy top with a sequined color. Hmm. Then we have this nice cream holy top at the um, shoulders. Which I think is really cute. And this is a chiffon heart printed red top, which is so the love. But you have to wear it with a belt or else it'll be too huge. And this is just an electric blue top, which I just love because of the sleeves because it's just so bubbly. See? And this is just such a pretty, dusty pink dress. And I bought another one in navy blue. And this is just a red maroonish dress, which is asymmetrical at the bottom, which not really asymmetrical, it's more of a teal lip design. And this is a flowy cream skirt, which I think will look pretty cute because it just flows when you move. And this is another tulip asymmetrical skirt, which is in super red, which I think is pretty hot. This brownish gray skirt has a glittery waistband, and um, it's long all the way down, but it's see-through at the bottom, so really nice. And this dress, mm -hmm, this dress just reminds me of beaches and ooh, Malibu. And I also got one thing that cannot be categorized into any of those categories I mentioned. But I think it can be categorized under all of the categories that I mentioned. Hmm. Anyways, I got these DIY studs. I don't know whether you can see the design. Wait, let me try to get one stray one out. Oh, go out. This one. Looks like that. No, I don't know when you can see that. It's glare. So basically, it's just a round kind of pointy tipped one and it's got like a pointy backside, <laughs> pointy end so it's for DIY like if you want to do like a denim studded I don't know shirt or something I can just poke them in and kind of bend the other end down so that it kind of stays so yeah I got this one but I have yet to figure out what I want to do with this one probably I'll set some of my um bags, clothes, shoes. That's why I said this can be categorized under everything. So, yeah. Oh, and one more thing that I forgot to mention that I think deserves to be in this haul is this cute little umbrella that I got. Um, I just, when I first saw it, my friend pointed it out to me and I was like, oh my god, I've got to have that. And it's just so colorful and bright and so rainbow-ish. It's just so eye-catching. It's just so, oh, so pretty. But I'm not going to open it because I'm just too scared of opening it because the last time I opened it, it broke. So <laughs> I had to go back and change for a new one. Um, and ever since then, I've been kind of scared to open it. So yeah, love, love, love this one. I think this one was only for right, like, I don't know, less than 30 ringgit. Love it. So yeah, I guess that concludes my haul video. These are all the items I bought and I bought them with my own money. So I feel like, you know, when you buy something with your own money, you love them even more. So I wish to love them even more than I already am in love with them. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this. I know it's going to be super duper long because I'm like literally looking at the timing for each video and I know that it's going to take ages. But um, yeah, uh, I hope 
you guys don't think that I'm trying to brag or anything. I just wanted to kind of share with you, you know, what I bought. And hopefully, you know, if you like some of them, you can ask me how much it costs or where I got them if you're going to Bangkok anytime soon. So, yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!